Ivan Konstantinovich Arnazovsky was an outstanding Russian artist. He developed for himself a special method of paint and a picture in which the artist produces meaning for work in nature, and then from memory he reproduces the calm sea and raging ocean with extraordinary fluency. Ivan Ivadovsky was born in the family of Armenian merchants. Despite the fact that the father was ruined and had no opportunity to give children a decent education, Ivadovsky found patterns. The first support was provided by Theodosian architect Yakov Koch. Ivadovsky was supported also by Alexander Kostnichev, the senator of Tauret province. He paid for Ivadovsky's vacation. Then, thanks to the patronage of Natalia Nalushkina, the wife of Tauret governor and the famous portrait painter, Ivadovsky was assigned to the Imperial um, Academy of Arts in St. Petersburg when he was 14 years old. So, Ivadovsky's career was very successful. The picture, Best of Pompey, was painted in 1889 and was based on the real historical events which occurred in 79 BC. During the eruption of the Italian volcano Vesuvius, many people and several cities died under a water of lava and ash. Terrible plot, the power of natural element, the combination of destructive and beautiful, were attracted by the romantic artist Ivazovsky. He demonstrated tragedy from the sea, which made it possible to entirely scale. What a formidable volcano and a destroyed city and waters illuminated by an ominous light. On the upper right of the picture, there is a purple peak of the volcano, and at the foot of the volcano, there is a lava covered city. On the left part of the picture, there is a mountain slope uh, that is illuminated by a natural light. There is, there is only one light source that can illuminate this light, and it is terrifying lava. However, in real life, there was no lava in the city. It was covered only by pumice and ash. Small rowing boats and large sailboats were loaded with people are in a hurry to get away from the dangerous shore into the open sea. In reality, during the eruption of Vesuvius, there were no boats near the shore. All the residents of Pompeii, who managed to escape, left the city a few days before the tragedy and the first aftershocks. Everyone else died. Ivozovsky paid special attention to the light passing through the waves in the painting The Death of Pompeii. The sea on the canvas seems to consist of contrasting flashes and gaping holes of darkness. The color of the painting, a combination of disturbing red and deep black, immerses the viewer in the atmosphere of disaster and pain. Ivozovsky found the right visual means to convey the horror of the death of Pompeii. However, as a romantic artist, he saw in the destructive element not only a tragedy, but also a spectacular spectacle that shocked the human imagination. If chosen this particular painting, because it impressed us the most with its size, as well as the color scheme, red, orange, dark colors, convey as much as possible the atmosphere of horror that the citizens of the dying city experienced.